What's up, guys? 9 to 2010 from I got a review for you today on uh, Alfaker Energy Drink. Uh, there's not much left in the bag because I picked it up in a trade. Uh, I think, I'm pretty sure Colby sent this to me. Uh, I might be wrong, but Colby, thank you for sending this to me. Uh, appreciate it. Uh, finally got around to smoking this, so um, talk about a little bit. I'm not going to show it to you guys because, like I said, there's not much left in the bag. Uh, my Tangier small funnel took up a, pretty much all of it. There's like maybe a half a bowl left. I'll probably use it uh, in a pico bowl or something. But um, the smell on it was kind of tart. It smells a little bit like a like a stereotypical energy drink, whether it be Monster, Full Throttle, uh, Red Bull, anything like that. Uh, most people say that it tastes and smells like Red Bull. I didn't pick up specifically Red Bull, but it does smell like a generic for the most part, energy drink. Um, it's got that little bit of tartness to it with a little bit of sweet, like the sugar overload kind of a thing going on. So that is there. Um, and then the cut was standard Alfaker cut. It was a fine cut, dyed red, and very, very juicy. Uh, so that's why I packed it into a Tanger's Funnel Bowl. Um, I am using my KML Zone, a, like I said, Tanger's Small Funnel, three Coco Jamras, and a social smoke professional lounge hose. Um, so let's see what we got. Been going for probably close to an hour. I'm, I'm almost positive it was close to an hour, but the coals are still pretty big, so I might be a little bit shy of an hour. Um, anyway. Um, taste is kind of weird. Um, not necessarily an energy drink. It, it, you do get that tart in there a little bit, like that little bit of a kick. Um, kind of hard to place. It tastes a lot like Mobster from Social Smoke, if you ever had that. Uh, a lot of people that have had this are probably going to see this and say, oh, you know, no, it's not even close. How can you compare it? But in my defense, it's been over a year and a half since I had Mobster. Um, and that was one of my top flavors from Social Smoke back when I got it. But from what I can remember that long ago, uh, this is pretty similar. Um, yeah. Nice, poofy, white, very, very, very dense Alfaker clouds. Good for playing with. If you're the kind of person that likes to blow rings or play with the smoke, you'll enjoy Alfaker. It's good smoke for that. Um, It's a pretty, it's a pretty mellow, but not too mellow flavor. It's not like crazy in your face, but it is very easy to pick up. Um, that's decent though. I mean, I probably wouldn't buy 250 grams of this just because I'm not a fan of like the um, modern crazy flavors, but um it is pretty decent. I mean, I'll go with like a 7 out of 10. There's a little bit of a metallic, um, not chemical, but it, it tastes a little bit like metal, like cold metal, um, if that makes any sense. It's kind of weird, but it's not terrible. I mean, it's decent. It's an average flavor, so I, I'd give it that, you know, 7 out of 10. But uh, I probably wouldn't buy... Uh, oh, sorry. Excuse me. I don't know why I always burp when I smoke hookah, but, um, yeah, that's really all I can say for it. Um, if you're in the mobster energy drink, um, tartness flavors, if that makes sense, uh, you'll probably like this. I'd recommend trying this. So, um, yeah, guys, that's really all I got. <laughs>
Um, not much else to say about it. 7 out of 10, Al Fokker Energy from me. If you like my reviews, subscribe. Try and get a lot more coming out here pretty soon. Um, yeah. Happy uh, 5th of November for those of you that are into Guy Fox, Boo for Vendetta, Anarchy, all that. I love it. Today's one of my favorite days of the year. Um, not necessarily a major holiday, but hey, go out and wreak some havoc legally. Anyway, um, I was going to wear my Guy Fox mask for this, but I can't find it. I think it's at the other house in my box of stuff that I haven't moved over yet, but I was really excited for that to do a November 5th review and wear my mask, but oh well, you get the point. Anyway, um, yeah guys, subscribe, comment, let me know what you think about the flavor, or uh, if you've had Mobster, if you think they're close at all, let me know. And I'll see you guys in the near future. So, take it easy.